Hey YouTube, so this is an original Lego Ninjago and this is not an original Lego Ninjago, this is, as uh, we see here, a Jinran Ninjago Masters of Spinjitsu, whatever type of Lego, it's a fake Lego but uh, why would you buy something like that? Well, because uh, this thing here with other two figures costed around I believe 15 euros and this thing with two figures and one motorcycle cost just one euro and there were other sets like the one over here that uh, have a similar uh, a very low price from three to five euros so I want to check the quality of this thing and if it's worth even one euro given the food for one euro I believe it was a good bargain to see if it's similar to a Lego or not and we can see in the box in the back it says that it has uh, other let's focus here okay it has uh, a total of eight sets of guys with motorcycles and uh, two figures and that's not it, it that's about it about the box we don't have anything more to see six to twelve years old and also it says here that's better than you not buy it if your kid is uh, i believe it's zero to three because it has a much small part so let's open this thing up and let's see what's in this small box so it had the parts in small boxes like that small bags like that and of course there is no uh, uh, instructions of how to build it so let's i'm not going to show you how we, we build this because apparently it's something very easy to do but i'm going to construct them and then i'm going we're going to compare the quality to a figure because this is just a figure we're going to compare, we're going to, compare it to this guy or girl i would say it's i think it's nia to this guy Kai here. So from and the beginning so of on. the set, you can see that the finish. If you can focus better, it's not that good. This thing also has its hands missing, whereas the finish in this one, which is, this is an original Lego, is better than this. But this is only if you check on the minor details. We're gonna put them together and see it better. But then the the, the, the those parts fit that they seem to be like Lego like so you can use them both so let's assemble them and let's see what they look like so that's what the set looks like from the beginning from the spare parts you can see that the quality is something that is made this is supposed to be a hand a spare hand but it's almost destroyed you can see here it's off and I did not do anything about this I don't know what this thing is here I could not find to put it in anywhere in the bike and let's take a closer look at those guys let's focus here so the fit and finish is bad to say the least this guy here has something in his head also one other different thing is like you can see here that I try to push these things all the way back but I cannot do that so again it's a thing of Finish. Let's compare it to, the, to this hand. This is an original Lego. This extends quite some. But also, as I showed you in the beginning, the painting on this thing is. If you take a closer look at it, it's not that good. Other than that, if we take this guy off, you can see that it has those Lego-like uh, legs, joints for uh, to, to his upper torso. Let's take a look at the bike. Same things here, no instructions. I don't think in the original Lego the swords come off that easily. And again, his hands here. Let's take this guy off. It's a simple back two pieces. I cannot find out again where this thing goes in. Anyway, again, this guy hands again they extend a bit too much. He has this kind of sword uh, that this guy Kai has and the swords are wobbly again also the face on those two get on those two guys are it's exactly the same face they don't have a different face uh, like this girl here she she has a different look and every figure in the original lego has a different look and now it's a bit it's a matter of preference if you want to buy a set that costs just one euro uh, and perhaps you can find it online even cheaper uh, the bike unfortunately does not stand up it just falls down I've seen in other Legos uh, especially police bike that they do set up this 
cannot find balance. What happens to this guy wearing those too many things because I can see that, oh no, it down fell from the other side. And it has the stand here, as I said, some spare parts which are not of very good quality. And in general, you take your chances when you're buying non-original Lego. They look Lego-like, I can say that. Uh, but they're flimsy, their hands are about to come off. And you have to do some problem, I'm going to have to use some cutters to, to cut his hands to make him smaller so he can fit a bit better. Uh, but other than that, if from a distance they, they look Legos, but as I say, you, you get what you pay for. And let's take a closer look at them again. This is what was in the box. It's a matter of preference. Anyway, thanks for watching. Please like and subscribe.